Time now for ABC4 News Sports with Dana Green. BYU had already locked up a spot in the big dance, but they never won the West Coast Conference Tournament title. And what an effort against the top-ranked team in the nation tonight. Gonzaga, third time they faced the Bulldogs this season. You couldn't play a better half than the Cougars played in the first half. Trevin Nell setting the tone. Brandon Averett hits the pull-up three. BYU made nine three balls in the first half. The lead is seven. Matt Harms doing harm. Remember, BYU trailed 23-2 and 15-2 the first two times they played. Tonight, how about a 10-point lead? Spencer Johnson from distance. Cougars shot 68% from the field in the half. Alex it's Barcella from way out, and then it's Trevin Nell again. Nell, yeah, BYU's up 12 at the half, 53-41. Largest deficit for Gonzaga all year. You knew they'd make a run, and here they come. Corey Kispert cuts it to three, but BYU didn't go anywhere. Gideon George, the baseline drive, and the flex. He had 11, then it's Barcelo going strong with the hoop and the foul. He had 15. BYU's back up by nine with nine to go, but then Gonzaga goes on a 12-0 run. Kispert on the break, hits the bucket, and one. Gonzaga eventually goes up by three, but BYU keeps fighting. Trevin Nell, a career-high 20 points. We're tied at 71. In crunch time, Jalen Suggs taking over. Maybe the best player in the country. Hits a couple of dagger three balls, finishes with 23 points. BYU scored 53 in the first half, just 25 in the second half. 30 straight wins now for Gonzaga. Final 88-78. Cougars now await selection Sunday to find out who they'll be playing in the NCAA tournament. You know, credit to Gonzaga for, for uh, putting some pressure on us. I felt like we were uh, trying to manage a little bit of um, fatigue, a little bit of uh, running out of gas, a little bit. Um, so it's a combination of those two things I thought was significant. Just super disappointing, but really proud of our team and proud of our guys. I thought we started out great. Our mindset was great coming into the game. I mean, we, we knew that, you know, if any team's going to beat them, we were the team. Gonzaga responded in the second half. We, we had a really good first half. And then uh, some shots didn't fall for us. We didn't grab a couple of rebounds in the second half and, and Gonzaga pulled away.